So now we got Florida Atlantic at 6.30, traveling to number 13, Florida. Uh, FAU lost to Marshall 20-9 last year and Georgia Southern 20-3. Uh, those were their big losses last year. Now, Florida, on the other hand, they had that Florida, Texas, they had a very good year last year. Obviously, you had the Texas A&M loss, 38-41. They lost to LSU. Uh, if you remember that game, they went 30, the final score 37-34. That was a big deal because it knocked Florida out of playoff contention. And then they had the 24-17 uh, win over. Oh, 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 oh. Um. I actually don't know. I don't know what my dad just wrote. But they did uh, beat, they did play uh, Alabama rather close, and they did have a big win over Georgia last year. I'd say last year was a successful season for Florida, but they do have to replace a lot of key playmakers, including Kadarius, Tony, and their starting quarterback, Kyle Trask. So it's going to be a big deal. But Florida Atlantic is a good game to start out with, especially without Lane Kiffin there. Uh, Florida's here, but 24 and a half points. I expect that to stay, and I expect Florida to cover that. Oh, my God.